going on everybody welcome back to RC car garage and today as you guys can see we are going to be dealing with the Radio Shack Carmichael I forget his name <laughs> but it's a Carmichael um, RC bike so I hey how are you <laughs> so I have been wanting to get an RC motorcycle for quite some time and as you guys saw in my last video from the hot uh, swap meet I picked this thing up for 50 bucks again it's not the one that I wanted per se but it is a hobby grade Realistically, even though it's from Radio Shack, it is a hobby grade um, RC motorcycle. So I have been wanting to get one for quite some time. Like I said, the shocks I tried it last time, and they do work. I thought that they were going to need. Um, they might. I don't know if they take oil in it or not. Um, I have to do some more research into that. But. Um, I saw it, I'm like, yo, I've been wanting to get one for quite some time. I'm going to pick this guy up. So we are going to, uh, I went over it a little bit um, in that last video. But we are going to take this guy outside, test it, and I don't know what else we're going to do with it. Um, I was thinking of cleaning it up. And just putting it up on the shelf and just keeping it as a, um, you know, not a memento sort of thing. But, you know, it's keeping it up on the shelf out of the way. And that's what I was thinking about doing. But then again, I've been thinking that maybe, just maybe, I might do something else with it. Uh, one of the reasons why I kind of want to keep it on the shelf is because finding parts for this thing is going to be a pain in the butt. Um, I don't want to break it. Um, I really don't want to break it, to be honest with you. And again, like I said, finding parts for it is going to be a pain in the butt. Um, I saw a video on YouTube where a guy actually had one of these and he upgraded the ESC. Um, he upgraded the ESC and the battery cover was missing. So he made his own little thing with that. Um, no, it wasn't. Yeah, he changed the ESC because he was missing the radio. Luckily for me, I have the radio for it, but it's an old style radio. <laughs> so, Ricky Carmichael, guys, the Ricky Carmichael RC motorcycle. So, this is the controller that comes with the bike. Again, Radio Shack, as you guys can see right there, Radio Shack. If you guys all know, a lot of you may know, Radio Shack has not been in business for years. I used to love going to Radio Shack. I'd go there just to browse, even though I wasn't buying anything. <laughs> I used to love going to Radio Shack. Um, but, so, I mean, with that being said, um, finding parts for this thing is absolutely, you can't. You really cannot find parts for this. So, I don't want to break it. Um, the video that I was telling you guys about that I saw, the guy that changed out the ESC and everything, the tires on it were completely all cracked. And he ended up putting some tape on it to prevent it from expanding and breaking even more. Um, which I completely understand. But... Again, parts for this thing are hard to find. So, we are going to take it out. Um, 
see what it can do. Because I've been wanting to take this thing out for a while. And luckily, I got home from work in the perfect time before I have to go pick up my daughter. So, enough blabbing. Uh, let's take this thing outside and let's see what it can do. Alright, so we're outside right now. Um, I'm going to try, my grass is a little high. So, I'm going to try to get this thing going. Uh, let's turn it on and let's turn it on and see how it goes. All right, so there we have it. Here she is. I got the controller. It is on. You guys can see the red light right there. Got the bike it is on. Got a 5,000 moss 7.4 volt battery. So hopefully you guys can see. There it goes. So let's see how old this thing is going to work out. Um, I haven't done anything with it, so let's uh, go. Let's let's go. Okay, he just wants to let me get this thing going. out too well now did it all right so she just <laughs> I need a bigger uh, area for this thing yeah so I don't know if it's my battery that's uh not all that great on this but even the steering seems a little not that great for it um, so let's uh, go ahead and try this thing again I don't know what the heck it might be my battery yeah I'm not doing too great with this I'm really not doing too great with this thing Let's try this again. So I just don't think it has a speed. <sighs> I don't think it has a speed to drive on grass. Um, it's starting to get annoying. It's starting to get really annoying, man. I'm going to have to get like a... Uh, gonna have to go to like a big field or something so let's try this again well yeah I'm gonna have to try to take this thing out on a like a field like a big parking lot um, yeah like I said this is an old guy old one guys this thing's old I think it might be my battery that's just not Yeah, I think it's my battery. Because this thing ain't going... This thing ain't doing what I want it to do. It might be my battery. I have a charge, but this battery kind of sucks, really. Yeah, I, I think my battery for this thing is no good. So, let me uh, see if I can get a new battery for it. Alright, so, change the battery. Uh, <laughs> put my other 7.2 volt 
5000 mAh battery that it's a 10 energy which works a lot better than that other one that I had in here uh, the only thing is that the battery is a little bit bigger if you guys can see here it's the bottom right there is poking out a little bit the battery is a little bit too big for this but for testing purposes I think this is gonna work out perfectly so let's give this thing a shot again There we go. Yep, I need a way bigger area than what I got. All right, so this thing cannot go on grass. Uh, yeah. This thing cannot go on grass. All I'm doing is just beating it up, really. Let's try this again. All right, let me do it like this way. Well, got a little further than not really so yeah so guys it looks like that I'm gonna need a bigger parking lot area to take this thing on um, the guy that sold it to me he did say that he you know it does need a big area for this thing to perform um, unfortunately I don't have that big area I was kind of hoping that this thing would have been able to ride on the grass um, but it doesn't so the back of it has the balance um, has the balance um, gyro thing in the back that keeps it balanced but the issue is that I don't think this thing is fast enough to be able to oh wait hold on hold on let me try something here hold on I think I hold on. All right, let me try this again. Cuz I really want to see this thing perform, dude. Yeah. So this thing is just not powerful enough to be able to go either that or this battery isn't powerful enough because this thing seems like it doesn't even want to run anymore to be honest with you that's the thing man Knock had batteries, nickel metal batteries. See it? It was just running good. Yeah. So I don't know if you guys can hear that. It's got a mechanical thing on the inside that keeps it going. Um, so I did, what I did find out is that this little gas cap right here unscrews there. That unscrews from there. This body pin comes off, body clip comes off right back there. Ricky Carmichael goes up a little bit and this whole piece comes off. 
there's a battery pack that's right in here I am thinking that maybe these batteries are no good or something I don't know I'm not sure but I'm going to change out these batteries put some new batteries in it and see what the deal is see if that makes a difference because I just charged that battery there's no way that that nickel metal battery is off it is no good no more and the other thing I just found out is the spring right here I don't know if you guys can see that so there's a little spring right there that got disconnected that's for the steering so I think this guy that had it um spring must have broke or something he changed out the spring and that's why it's not running correctly or steering in this case because even i tried to that's why that's why the things looked a little off so let me i'm going to put that in there like that so let me see if i can get some double a batteries throw them in here and see if that makes a difference guys new fresh batteries throwing these guys in so now let's see if this makes a difference I'll put you there see if this makes a difference for this thing no no nope, battery's dead all right guys well there we have it let me adjust you guys here there you go so there you got it have it the ricky carmichael uh RC motorcycle like I said I rate I think I did that <laughs> um, a couple things to lose here but I think I did that right there I'm not sure so uh, a couple more scuff marks so like I said this guy I don't want to break it um, I don't want anything to break because parts for this are going to be hard to find so I don't want to break it so what I'm more than likely going to do with it is leave this as a I don't know where this went to but <laughs> I'm going to leave this as a shelf queen basically it's going to put it up on the shelf I think it looks pretty cool so that's what I am going to do with it I'm going to leave it up on the shelf um, tried it out and I did what I wanted to do with it so there we have it the ricky carmichael radio shack the radio shack ricky carmichael uh cr 250 race bike um that's all i got for you guys so hope you guys liked it enjoy the video and i will see you guys in the next one you all have a good one guys